Hello guys, it's me, Lily, and I'm um, sorry if you hear any background noises. My sister, my twin, not the one that always makes noise on my videos, but my twin is here. And as you can tell, I got some more Halloween decorated decorations up, which I think I'm going to take down these pumpkin lights, only because they kind of stop and it looks kind of stupid because you can only, if I like that, you can only see one, two, three, four, five, six, and one or two doesn't work. So, I hope you guys like these decorations, and it is currently 8.42 in the morning, and it's because, um, first of all, what happened yesterday, there was a huge problem, and I'm very sorry for that, that it came out in two parts, and then I said I'm really sorry. You know, I'm just going to kind of ignore that. Um, but yesterday, I wasn't expecting... Uh, gonna do something else but then uh we went my family sorry I feel I I saw really bad so then my family decided to uh go to Jamestown and we visited our cousins sorry if the tripod shaking that's because my foot was touching it um um but another problem was is that the reason I'm filming so early in the morning is because my sister and maybe her friend might be coming over at 10 o'clock um and and then we're going to um acres of terror and that's why her friend is um coming over because she's going with her okay sorry i thought they're pulling up and um uh one second Okay, sorry for that. Um, so we're going to Acres of Terror, and it's um, the place we're going is about two and a half hours away, which by the time we get there, it's going to be like 7, maybe 8 o'clock, and then, you know, then we're going to do that. Might take an hour, and then they get, which is 9, and then it might take an hour. It's going to be 12. So I can't, like, be, like, running around, and I know it's not exactly 24 hours a day, but it technically is because each day one's getting uploaded, but it's not all straight bro. But I know it's not dark out, and I get that. I'm gonna try to make it more darker, and then I'm gonna tell a scary story to tell it down. Okay, this is the best it can be. I shut off the light, and I put a blanket over the window, but there's a little crease down there. So you're just gonna get this. But let's go. Really, it's dead. It died on me, guys. It died when I needed it. We'll be back. Sorry for the complications. Okay. We got the complications sorted. Really? One night. Little boys were walking in the woods. And they heard a little leaves rushing. They got freaked out a little, but they didn't really care. So they kept walking to go to the next trick or, trick or treaters. And so they heard more leaves scrambling. So they decided to run back. And they heard the leaves faster, shh, 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 following them. <coughs> they ran as fast as they could to their house. Now remember, this is a full moon. So, the kids proceeded to lock the doors in their house. But they forgot one. The attic. When they went to sleep, Later that night, they heard rustling in the thing of It really freaked them out because they remembered that they forgot to lock the attic. So they ran down and they realized that their parents were out on a dinner date, even though it was 9 o'clock. So the kids went to call the police and the phone receiver was gone. 
they had no one to call. So they decided to run to the next neighbor. But they were miles away, like three miles away, and they knew that they could easily get caught. So they went to their room, locked the door, and barricaded it, and made sure the window was open so they could jump out. Then they heard footsteps. And they heard the knock on the door. And then they screamed a horrific scream. And they took the nearest weapon they could, which was a screwdriver. And they stayed at the door, barricading with their mouth closed and the screwdriver. Later... They heard a... They knew they were insane. And then, one of them felt the sharp pain on their foot. They realized that whatever it was, was scrape, scratching their foot. So the, they ran to the other side of the room. And with that, all the things in the barricade fell out. And they ran to their closets and hid with the nearest weapon they could, which was their screwdriver and their flat rod, their flat screwdriver, flathead. And they hid there for 30 minutes. And they heard clatter in the room. And they, they heard soft breathing. But it wasn't out in the room. It was right next to them in the closet. So they looked over and saw a horrific face of the werewolf man. They ran out of their closet and right into their brother, their older brother. He was playing a prank on them. Then they told him and he didn't believe them. And they heard a scream. And then was dark. Oh, it is right in here, so I lost the lights, but I hope you guys enjoyed that little scary story. Um, I will see you in part two, but it's going to be on Halloween night. So I will have videos coming out, and then on Halloween night, I will upload part two. You'll see part two. And then tell me what you think about this story. You like this? Should I keep it going? You know? But it was really fun to make. And my dad told me that story when I was a little kid. I was scared straight. But that is what I imagined him as a little kid. This one right here. Not the witch. Not the bat. Not the pumpkin. This one. So the reason I have this up is because... I should have kept that on while going, but... Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tell me some of your scary stories in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Oh, thank you for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thanks.